Thank you for joining us today. I'm Roger with CableGiant.com. We're here to show you how to install an F compression connector on a piece of RG6 60% coaxial cable used primarily for CATV applications. That's in your home to connect to your TV sets. First thing I would like to suggest before you start is make sure you assemble the right tools. Tools that I'd recommend are a good multi-cable cutter tool like this Klein, part number 63020. Uh, a good strip tool like the ICM PSA 59-6. This particular tool does both RG59, RG6, RG6 quad shield. It comes with an extra set of cutters and it has a fuel for cleaning out your RG6 uh, center connector. The other tool, the last tool, is the compression tool itself. This is made by ICM. It's called the SLM model and it does both RCAs BNCs and your F connectors. Also the connector itself, we like the uh, ICM connector. It's called an FS6U. This is a universal connector. Uh, the green color means that it's good for both RG6 and RG6 quad shield. Okay, let's get started. The first thing we need to do is we need to prepare the cable. This is a piece of RG6 60 percent which means that it has a, a 20, a 18 gauge center conductor and a 60% um, shield. So the first thing we want to do is set the strip tool up to strip RG6. Once you have the strip tool set up, also the other thing I like to do is put a piece of Velcro on, on the top of the strip tool that helps comb the braid down and simplify the installation process. Okay, once we uh, have the proper strip tool and the cable, we insert the cable into the stripper, turn it a couple times in each direction, and remove the outer jacket. That's going to leave a quarter inch, your center conductor, and your braid. The next thing you do is you take your Velcro or your fingers and comb the braid down. This will expose the dielectric which is coated with a thin foil. The next thing I like to do in preparing the cable is take your furl that's on your strip tool and clean the foil. It makes sure that it evens the foil out and at the same time it makes sure that all of the braid conductors that are braided down are away from the center conductor. That is the main thing. If you have any of these little braids touching the center conductor, you're going to short your cable and you're not going to have a good clear picture. Once you have your cable prepared correctly, you now grab the connector and these, again, the nice thing about the uh, FS connectors is there's no blind entry. There's a a little um, plastic uh, insert in the, in the bottom which allows you to, to guide, guide the cable into the connector allowing you to push it forward and, it, and when it pops out like that and your pin sticks out at least a uh, sixteenth of an inch you know you have the connector on the cable correctly. The next thing you do is grab your compression tool and insert the connector in the tool like that. Bring the handle down compressing the connector and now you have a completely installed F connector on an RG6 cable. The same connector again will work with RG6 quad shield. It's a little different in setting up the cable and we'll show you that on a future video. We thank you for joining us today and we hope uh, we've made a difference in your life. Have a good day and thank you again.